um, and I know that I don't need to tell you from the previous sessions that we've had so far that it's been quite impactful, it's been insightful, and it's been a time of learning, it's been a time of relearning, and today is not going to be any different from what we've seen so far at the Path to Success Conference. So get ready, buckle your seatbelt, we are about to move. Before we move, let me know how you're doing, how are you feeling, are you feeling excited for today? Let me know how you are feeling before we get started, like what are you expecting? What's going to happen? Okay, hi. Are you good? Are you excited? How is it going to be? Like I always say, don't be scared of using the chat box. That's the only way we are going to feel you. And we do want to feel you, right? So we want to know that. The, the, I, want, I want to know that I have energy. So let's get it going. Let's. Get it going. Welcome once again. Heart to Success Conference is going to be explosive. It's going to be explosive. I know that we have learned a lot of things. And like some of the speakers have said here already, and Miss Catherine as well, we should um, end the vote. Doesn't know what to do. Always apply it. Thank you all for tuning in again. Again, I'd like to hand over to Miss Catherine for a few words before we go further into today's session. Miss Catherine, you can hear me. The floor is yours. Good evening. Good evening. I trust you're fine. Good evening, how are we doing? Welcome to day three. Day three, I hope and I trust we are super excited and we have come with an open mind to learn how to leverage the social media for business and career growth. And like I said yesterday, there is no better person to facilitate the session than the social media mama, or maybe we can uh, we can uh, uh, take her to the post position of a grandmother. <laughs> no, she's not because she's still very young and popping. <laughs> so she is the social media grandmistress. Everywhere you see her page is always her page is always active, and then you wonder how how did she do it. Or how is she doing it? Because it's not a matter of what you did last year or last two years. It's a matter of how you consistently show up and the new techniques we, we apply to maintain our social media pages. So thank you so much. I can see she's already here. She came at about, say, five minutes before five. Thank you so much, ma'am. Um, I wouldn't be the one to, <laughs> to introduce you. Let me not steal that spotlight from Ms. Ebera. I just want to say thank you. We appreciate the fact that you are here and we can't wait to learn from you. Thank you so much. And thank you to everyone. Please do well to share the links to your friends and um, families, colleagues, and the likes of them. Thank you. I'll now relinquish control to our ever beautiful Ms. Ebera Emanuels. Over to you, Ms. Ebera. Can you hear me? Okay. Loud and clear. All right. Okay, I'll go 
Gate Pool, a female with over 14 years legal culinary instructor, a brand ambassador to Mamador, and multiple award-winning food blogger. She is a creative director and community manager of IFIS. Kitchen, an online platform for audience, if site and lifestyle blogs. She also provides online cookery courses and food consulting services. Before setting up Ife's Kitchen in 2016, she worked as a corporate and commercial lawyer with Acres Ife 2020. Her disabilities were advising companies on corporate governance and statutory and regulatory compliance matters. She is well known for her work in assisting companies in the establish establishments of codes of corporate as she had a good number of free position media. She managed Ife's Kitchen alongside her role at Acres until up to 2021, where she resigned to pursue her passion full-time as the Ife's Kitchen brand and her brand from publishing TV hosts on her cooking show aired on DSTV a major satellite television, television service, and YouTube. She also provides food consulting service. To restaurants, both in Nigeria, a strong community, young food lovers on the various social media platforms, and has inspired millions around the world to cook. When Ife is not busy developing recipes and creating content, she loves to travel, empower you. And to read fiction novels, some of her record 20, the Pine Awards for Food Blogger of the Year 2021. Winner, Post TV Food Influencer Awards 2021. Winner, Eloy Awards for Food Vlogger slash Entrepreneur 2021. Winner Trend Up Awards Food Blogger Vlogger of the Year 2022. Food Vlogger of the Year 2023 Gage Awards. Food Influencer of the Year Social Media Award. Social Media Awards. Ify can be found on Instagram at Ify's Kitchen, where she has over 1.8 million followers on Facebook at Ife's Kitchen and on YouTube at Ife's Kitchen and on TikTok at Ife.Kitchen. Sorry to interrupt you. At some point, we experienced network glitch from your end. So I don't know if you could switch off your camera and maybe start from... Uh, the part where we have um, she managed Ife's kitchen alongside, please. It's very important our attendees know who is speaking okay. with us today. Yes. Thank you so much. You can switch off your camera. All right. Thank you. Okay. Before setting up Ife's Kitchen in 2016, she worked as a corporate and commercial lawyer with Acres Law between 2013 to 2021. Her core responsibilities were advising com companies on corporate governance and statutory and regulate re regulatory compliance matters. She is well known for her work in assisting companies in the establishment of codes of corporate governance and varied policies to ensure their effective corporate and administrative regulation. If his kitchen brand took off quickly, as she had a good number of corporate clients partnering with her to strate strategically position her product to a large audience on social media. 
She managed Ife's Kitchen alongside her role at ACAS up until 2021, where she resigned to pursue her passion full-time as the Ife's Kitchen brand has significantly grown. She has expanded her brand from publishing Video recipes online to being a TV host and also also consulting services to restaurants both in Nigeria and abroad. Over the years, if he has built a strong community of over a million food lovers on her various social media platforms and has inspired millions around. Around the world to cook when if it is not she loves to travel and pair you as a set of twins. Some of our recognition awards include 2018 winner, the Pine Awards for Food Blogger of the Year. Twenty twenty one winner, host winner Eloy Awards twenty twenty one winner Trend of Awards Food Vlogger of the Year. Twenty twenty two Gage Awards Food Vlogger of the Year. Twenty twenty three winner. Food Influencer of the Year. At Ify's Kitchen, on YouTube at Ify's Kitchen, and on TikTok at Ify's Dot Kitchen. Ladies and gentlemen, please join me and welcome the social media mogul, Ifi Mwageku. A pleasure to have you here, ma'am. Okay, can you hear me now? Yes, we can hear you loud and clear. Welcome, Mom. You look so beautiful as always. Well, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And thank you for inviting me. I'm super excited. The pleasure is all ours. Yeah. Yeah, and um, thank you to everyone for taking time out of your very busy schedule. Well, um, I don't take it for granted that you can be here tonight. So thank you very much. And all the Ifinarians in the house, I see you, I acknowledge you. And um, yeah, I'm excited. So thank you. And yeah, thank you for that, you know, very elaborate introduction. So this is Ify basically, um, I guess Abera has said everything that needs to be known about me. If you if you have any questions, you can drop it in the chat box and we can start. So Miss Catherine, do I just take it off or do you have any questions? Do you want to, how, how do we do it? No, the stage is yours. Use it as it pleases you. <laughs> okay, all right. Thank you for that. All right. So, guys, um, I was invited to talk about oh. leveraging the social media for your business or career. So, basically, how mm -hmm. to use social media to grow your business and your career. And um, I think I I will do very good justice to that seeing that yeah. I have used social media as a tool to be where I am and where, you know, where I'm going to. Social media has been everything for me. So the first thing I'm going to say, if you're really, really keen and interested in using social media to build yourself, first thing, how many people have an online presence or how many business owners do we have here today? Show of hand, drop a message in the chat box. 